Today we are removing the stereo from a 2006 Chevy Impala. We're going to start with our pry tool and start on the uh, bottom edge of this panel around the car stereo. Work our way around. Find a way in here. And uh, release the clips here. The clips release with pry pressure. And then once we get it started, we're going to work our way all the way around. And that pulls the, the uh, panel forward. There is a little trigger on the connector at the airbag light here that we're going to push down and release. Now this uh, trigger is at the top of the connector and when you push it down with your thumb it lifts the uh, tab so it releases from the connector on the uh, face. Uh, next we're going to remove the two screws next to the AC controls here. The reason for removing the AC control here is because uh, the car stereo has a lip on the bottom of it along the edge here that goes behind the AC controls and will not come out of the dash unless the AC controls are pulled a little bit forward because the lip is here. Uh, next we're going to remove the bottom left mounting screw of the car stereo, the top left mounting screw of the car stereo, the uh, bottom right mounting screw from the car stereo, stereo from the dash. Uh, I can see the antenna has already been disconnected from this one. The antenna goes here in the corner. Usually you grab the uh, black collar on the antenna, lift it up and it removes. As for the remaining car stereo, there are two connectors here. One of them you have a trigger on that you push down and remove. The second also has a trigger that you push down into the connector and remove. Uh, these connectors the triggers are here on the top, and as you push them down, they lift up and release. Uh, this is how you remove the stereo from a 2006 Chevy Impala. Hope this removal has been helpful. Uh, you may find us at carstereohelp.com and carstereoremoval.com. Uh, please give our video a thumbs up, and hope this video has been helpful. Thank you.